New Bike Chemicals is down here at Republic Airport working on some leading edges. We have our New Shine 2, which is our graded system for metal polishing. We have a range of different abrasives. What we are going to work with today is going to be our F7, our C, and our S. Our F7 is our second most abrasive. You will use a rotary with a wool pad, typically starting around 2,000 RPMs. Our C is our middle abrasive. You'll use the same technique, rotary, wool pad, and 2,000 RPMs. When you get to our final finish, we're going to change it up a little bit. We go with the cyclo with cotton flannels over the head of your buffer. Aircraft are routinely cleaned on a 30 to 45 day cycle. While cleaning methods can vary, the focus is on improving the longevity of the aircraft's exterior appearance. For lightly pitted, very dull metal or new clad aluminum, you may require New Shine 2 F7. When starting your polishing endeavor, begin with a new or clean wool compounding pad on a circular or rotary type buffer. Wet a clean bristle one inch paintbrush or alternatively one finger with a dab of new shine polish, about one quarter to half of a teaspoon. Smear the dab of new shine approximately one and a half inch long or about a half of a finger length every three inches over an 18 to 24 inch target polish area. Place the clean wool compounding pad on the area and further smear the polish a little before turning on the buffer. We recommend running the buffer around 2000 RPMs. Do not lay the buffer flat against the metal polishing surface. Tilt the pad 10 to 15 degrees. Only one side of the pad should touch the surface as it spins. This helps pinpoint a specific target polish area. Beginning at the top left of your shoulder zone, work from left to right, right to left, left to right until you get to the bottom of your zone. When you get to the bottom right of your zone, work up, down, up, down, continuing this pattern until the black residue removes. The shoulder zone. Keep target polish area same width as shoulders, approximately 18 to 24 inches. Keep your feet flat on the ground, also within the shoulder parameter. Keep your eyes with the buffer. Never buff below the belt, meaning no bending over to meet lower levels. Best to keep your buffer at eye level. Black residue will form over the 18 to 24 inch target polish area. Continue moving your buffer back and forth, up and down, across the surface for about 30 to 45 seconds. The black residue will begin to lighten and disappear. Keep moving over your target polish area until the black residue is gone and the clean aluminum surface shows. New Shine 2S is our final finish. So when you're wanting that 10 to 15%, that extra show shine that's gonna give you that mirror, that clarity, that depth of shine that you're looking for, that's when you wanna finish with New Shine 2S. Take your cotton flannel sheets, lay the soft side down, and then start grabbing bottom left, bottom right, top left, top right, all hooking it and holding it into the handle on the top. Smear the dab of New Shine 2S approximately an inch and a half long or about half a finger length every six inches over an 18 to 24 inch target polish area. Move buffer over the surface area at a speed of about three seconds per foot. Use only light pressure. New images are non-fogging, cleaner, and debugger for polished metals. Great for cleaning polished skins on aircraft bellies and cowlings. Removing oils and fluids without the rainbow effect left on the surface from oil residue. Pour a small amount onto a flannel polishing cloth. Apply to surface, rub until new image is removed.